putting your DJI drone to work, but yet to unlock the full potential of your aerial data capture? Whether you're new to the world of photogrammetry or seeking an upgrade to your current workflow, it's time to see how you can elevate post-processing for your projects. Back in 2019, we launched DJI Terra, providing mapping software for DJI users. In the past five years and 49 software updates, we have worked hard to meet our users' needs and improve DJI Terra's capabilities. Fast forward to today, and DJI Terra efficiently turns vast aerial data sets into stunning 2D maps, 3D point clouds, and more. Let's dive into some of these improvements along with the capabilities of DJI Terra for your organization. To stitch together photos into our desired output, a photogrammetry engine is needed. The engineering efforts under the hood of the DJI Terra engine have focused on refining algorithms leading to substantial improvements in output quality and processing capability. If you flew a 650-acre development site with the Mavic 3 Enterprise at 400 feet, you'd be able to process the 2,000 overlapping photos into a 2D orthomosaic at an average rate of one hour. While for 3D models, DJI Terra processes an average of 700 Mavic 3 Enterprise photos per hour. DJI Terra optimizes for DJI drone data, automatically importing lens distortion information from DJI cameras, along with additional PPK processing features for photogrammetry coming soon to enhance the precision of geolocation data. This integration significantly reduces manual adjustments and improves the overall accuracy of the final model. Though you can create point clouds from photogrammetry, in the ever-evolving landscape of mapping and modeling, LiDAR data stands out for its capability to quickly create highly accurate and detailed 3D representation of the Earth's surface and its features, even in areas with dense vegetation. DJI Terra offers free LiDAR processing and tools for the L2, unlocking new possibilities for your projects. Though the DJI LiDAR payloads can collect both photogrammetry and LiDAR data, you can see the value of LiDAR in this vegetated area when trying to determine the details below the vegetation. So you're ready to harness the power of DJI Terra for your drone data processing. The first step is making sure you have the right equipment. For smooth performance and faster processing, we recommend Windows 10 or above, 64 gigs of RAM, and a NVIDIA RTX series graphics card. Based on your requirements, we have different licenses available, including an option for utilizing DJI Terra completely offline. And for those looking to streamline workflows at scale, we have a powerful new feature, the DJI Terra API. Connect existing tools and systems with the DJI Terra API to automate model reconstruction in the cloud. Check out our developer website for more information. So you've got DJI Terra set up and have completed flight operations. Now it's time to use the DJI Terra engine. Let's explore data processing and some of the tools available. It's easy to get started by importing your images, choosing a processing scene, and making any necessary adjustments to your settings, such as the coordinate system of your data. After aero triangulation has been completed, the region of interest tool can be used. If you've flown a crash scene, for example, and captured a larger area while on scene to be safe, ROI lets you define a specific region for your output so DJI Terra can focus its processing power on exactly what you need. This speeds up processing and provides a clean output based on the boundaries set. For many industries, improving and validating accuracy is key. One can easily import ground control point data and some of these points can be marked as checkpoints to verify the accuracy of your maps and models. DJI Terra even has the auto tagging capabilities to speed up the process. Check it out. At this point, we can go ahead and choose processing settings for the 2D map, 3D model, or point cloud that will be output and enable custom settings like refining water surfaces or making sure the lighting is uniform. DJI Terra provides seamless integration with the surveying industry through its robust coordinate transformation tools and options. These help ensure that drone data can align with existing geospatial data captured in projects that use local coordinate systems. This is crucial since surveyors use local projection coordinate systems to accurately represent project locations on Earth, and mapping software must convert between these systems to ensure correct data alignment. 
DJI Terra supports an EPSG library of geographic and projected coordinates for users to select from, along with the ability to perform seven parameter transformations or import a PRJ file for local arbitrary coordinate system transformations. This ensures that data output from DJI Terra can be directly applied to the project without any additional modifications. The LiDAR processing workflow shares similarities with photogrammetry, but offers the additional feature of ground layer classification. Following this step, DJI Terra directly generates a digital elevation model and contour lines. After processing, you can assess the thickness of the point cloud layer by examining the elevation profile and directly taking measurements within DJI Terra. After processing, DJI Terra generates comprehensive reports outlining the methodology and metrics used. This provides full transparency and helps you understand your data's reliability. The DJI Terra interface has been designed keeping usability in mind. The tools and menus are laid out logically, making the workflow smooth and easy to understand. After processing is finished, now it's time to turn our results into actionable deliverables. DJI Terra provides an array of tools for taking quick distance, area, and volumetric measurements directly on your 2D maps or 3D models. A major concern for Costa Rica is emergency preparedness for volcanic eruptions. The McGill Applied Remote Sensing Lab, alongside partners, created a reconstruction of the eastern section of the Volcan Poaz crater with data captured by the Zenmuse P1 full-frame photogrammetry camera. This output provided the most recent baseline data of the status of the crater because of a collapsed area, as well as a source for measurements used within CO2 flux calculations. DJI Terra offers a variety of export formats allowing you to integrate it with various GIS, CAD, and 3D modeling software. The Alaska Department of Transportation and Public Facilities has leveraged automated data capture through the DJI Dock and the subsequent exports from DJI Terra to run analysis on change detection based on elevation in areas with landslide risks. While DJI Terra excels at generating 3D models from drone data, sometimes these models require refinement. That's where DJI Modify comes in. This intelligent software is your tool for optimizing and polishing your 3D deliverables. Furthermore, you can easily generate shareable links, allowing clients, teammates, or other professionals to view your refined 3D models directly within a simple web interface. We've covered a lot of ground exploring DJI Terra's capabilities. The DJI Terra engines focus on optimizing output for DJI data combined with significant investments in R&D has resulted in a tool that is not only faster and more accurate than traditional methods, but also offers a scalable and cost-effective solution for a wide range of processing needs. Click the link in the description to get a free trial license and learn more about DJI Terra. Also, every new geospatial-related DJI Enterprise product, such as the Mavic 3 Enterprise, Mavic 3 Thermal, P1, and L2, comes with a DJI trial upon initial activation. The trial license is automatically linked to the DJI account after the product activation and can be bound to a PC by logging into the DJI Terra software. Thanks for joining me. We look forward to seeing what you create in DJI Terra.